been farming seaweeds actually for the last 50 years. Unfortunately, seaweed production has decreased over the years. Farmers have been complaining that they haven't earned a lot enough to live. They're very poor. And then the processors are complaining that the seaweeds coming from Tawi Tawi are really like low quality that they even stop buying from them. So given all these issues, we decided that, you know, maybe we should establish a seaweed research and development center. The Batana State College is the smallest SUC in the entire country in terms of uh, student population and in terms of land area. Research and development is one area that we still need to focus and improve on. The RD Lead program, therefore, is one program that uh, could really help us address this need to significantly strengthen and fortify our researchers' capabilities through the conduct of trainings and seminars, crafting of proposals, uh, mentoring of uh, family members, to name just a few. Yung Jida communities is uh, made of kawayan, barong barong. Tapos yung yung atip is amakan or ni pahat. And then, walang ilaw. So, ibig sabihin, ang iba gumagamit ng kerosene para sa ilaw during their dinner time. And then, instead of using kerosene, the solar project is an alternative and very beneficial. We met in one of the IP communities in the Davao City. So, since then, we had really a, an advocacy to really help IP communities uh, in terms of uplifting their lives. Indicative figures are pwede namin i-double yung income right now ng mga marginalized uh, farmers or itong mga IP communities natin. When I took in the BIS project, ang unang idea ko is uh, uh, to use the money to acquire research equipment for the benefit of our company. But I realized ko na itong mga advanced technologies na we are acquiring through BIS, eh, hindi lang sa akin makaka-benefit, but to the entire industry. Hindi na sila kailangan pumasok pa sa mga forested areas natin na protected areas at mag-harvest doon ng mga resources. So, natutulungan natin yung livelihood ng mga small farmers and IPs and at the same time, protect natin yung ating forest.